In this extra mini episode, we're going to take a look at a steering issue that a family friend had with his 2004 Ford F-150. The steering was feeling generally stiff, and on a cold morning, the steering wheel wouldn't recenter at all after a turn. I did a little bit of research on that, and it didn't take long to find that a common culprit of that issue on these trucks is the intermediate steering shaft. So to check it out for ourselves, what we'll do is jack up the front of the truck so that the wheels are off of the ground, then we'll turn the steering wheel and feel for tight spots. With the wheels off of the ground, this should be smooth and easy, but that's not quite the case. A significant binding could be felt in the steering wheel as the steering shaft U-joints rotated. So it seemed like this was probably our issue and we went ahead and removed it. The upper clamp bolt was easy to remove, although it took some doing to get to the lower one. But even after the bolts were out, it took probably 20 minutes of prying to get the shaft off of the steering rack. In the end, it took a creative application of two pry bars to compress the steering shaft and get it loose. And with the steering shaft removed from the vehicle, we'll clamp it down in the vise and test out the U-joints. The upper U-joint doesn't feel great, and it definitely has some tight spots. But the lower U-joint barely wants to move at all. It moves okay along one axis, but on the other, it's basically locked up. Even after clamping it down in the vise even tighter, I'm actually not even able to turn it all the way to the side. So, how can we correct this? Well, the only permanent solution would be to replace the steering shaft, and even that is probably not quite so permanent. What we did was basically just coat the entire U-joint assemblies with engine oil and work them back and forth until they loosened up. The joints didn't feel like they were broken, so there was probably just contamination that got through the seals and was causing everything to bind up. There's not really any way to replace these joints other than replacing the entire assembly, so just kind of loosening things up with some oil seems like the best solution. Of course, since this is a steering part and it is very vital to the function of the vehicle, if there are any future problems, it would definitely be for the best just to replace it. But after loosening things up, the joints seem to move really well, and there also isn't any looseness felt in the assembly. We reinstalled the steering shaft assembly into the truck, and after another test it seemed like everything was turning easily. And of course, we farther confirmed this with a road test, where we found that the steering wheel recentered very easily, and it didn't seem like any of the force required to turn it was excessive. This kind of is just a band-aid fix, but it's worked well so far. We loosened up the steering shaft in April of 2018, and it hasn't shown any issues yet. It's worth keeping an eye on it and making sure nothing starts to loosen up, but for now, it's doing just fine.